Hi, I am Alma Barsaga and I'm discussing to you workplace ethics. There are 10 slides to present and Learning Objectives What is Workplace Ethics? These ethics are implemented by employers to foster both employee-to-employee relationships and employee-to-customer relationships. An organization may decide to put these ethics into writing or not. They are, however, meant to be followed. The following are examples of ethical behaviors in the workplace. They say integrity is doing what is right when no one is looking. It is easier said than done, right? Why? Because it is much easier to take shortcuts. And an identical workplace behavior such as the following are shortcuts to achieve one's desired goals. Here are the unethical workplace behavior. Have you ever heard of the saying, familiarity breeds contempt? The purpose of workplace ethics, especially those that apply to leadership and management positions, is to prevent crossing that thin line between them and regular employees. Here are the lists of the management employers' unethical behaviors. As human beings are not infallible, unethical behaviors could arise. So, what can be done to prevent making the same mistakes? The following are strategies that have proven to be effective. How to solve unethical issues at the workplace Ethics guides one's moral compass. When we are conscious of our ethics, it can guide our ways of living, including our actions and behaviors in the workplace. To learn about examples of unethical behaviors and strategies that can be done to correct them. Being mindful of workplace ethics is important to prevent unnecessary disruptions in productivity. Finally, it is important to always consult your handbook for any workplace-specific ethics to be a well-informed employee. Thank you to Professor Alice Descalar. This is Ms. Alma Barsaga. End of my presentation. Thank you, everyone.